A young girl is empowering others through dolls. In this Black History Month special, Fox 5's Denise Dillon talks to the 10-year-old CEO of Beautiful Curly Me about how she is making history and helping others. This is Layla and this is Anika. They were created by a young girl and her mom who built a company and are now building confidence in girls around the world. So this is Layla, our fro queen, and then Anika, she has braids, and both of their names mean beautiful. Two dolls and a 10-year-old girl on a mission to empower young black girls everywhere. Zoe Oli is the CEO of Beautiful Curly Me, a company that started when Zoe was just a little girl who wanted to be like others. When I was six years old, I really did not like my hair and I wish it was straight like my classmates. I was taken aback, I didn't know what to do. My job as a mom is to empower my daughter and to help her feel comfortable and confident. Zoe's mom, Ivana, bought her a black doll, but it wasn't quite right. The doll had the same skin tone, but it had silky straight hair. When they couldn't find one, Zoe decided they could make their own. She's like, mommy, I wanna make dolls. I wanna make a doll with curls. I wanna make a doll with braids. That's how beautiful Curly Me was launched. Now, there's Anika and Layla, who also comes in a biracial version, and a smaller doll, Bella. There are sleep caps, hair care products, apparel, and affirmation puzzles. Beautiful curly me. Zoe has even written a couple of books. And it really helps girls to celebrate their differences. Curly, confident, smart, kind, with a smile that lights up the sky. From packing shipments, to talking to vendors and setting up strategy sessions. Zoe is involved in every aspect of the business. She's designing graphics in Canva and uh, putting up social media posts. Welcome to Bedtime Books and More. The Olies don't want anyone to be left out. They have a gift a doll program. Anyone can buy a doll and donate it to a girl in need. Zoe and her mom deliver them to various organizations. I am here at the Atlantis Children's Shelter. With every delivery, Beautiful Curly Me is changing attitudes and changing lives. It might just look like a doll or a book, but we're really just building those blocks of confidence in our young girls. Let me ask you this. You didn't like your hair when you were six. How do you feel about it now? I love my hair. I absolutely love my curls. And I really want other girls to feel that way. Zoe has big plans. She's starting a podcast and a girls club, and she wants to donate $5,000 to girls in need, helping them feel confident with a doll that reflects their natural beauty. Denise Stillen, Fox 5 News. And she